Hey guys, just wanted to check in and let you know that I've aborted my mission of a ride this morning. The original plan was to get out on the road and do a ride probably around that 90 minute mark with some variation in cadence and intensity on the uh, freshly serviced bike that's time trial bike that's sitting next to me. It's got the race wheels on, it's clean, new chain, everything. So I was pretty motivated and excited to get that ride done, but that didn't work out. And then I opted for a, a, a well, I was gonna do a pretty decent session on the trainer. Um, but uh, from the first pedal stroke, I knew I wasn't, wasn't uh, feeling great. So I did all the right things. I've, I've eaten this morning, I've hydrated, I had a fairly decent sleep. Um, and I'm motivated, mentally and emotionally, I'm fine. But from the first pedal stroke, yeah, physically, I could tell it wasn't there. So I did, um, did a longer warm up, did a good, decent pre-main set to see if I could wake the body up. Um, and after all that, I, I knew it still wasn't happening. So I opted for doing some sort of, some feel good efforts for 10 minutes, but about halfway through then, like, through that first one, uh, that wasn't feeling good either. And I decided to make the call. Um, it's something that I've probably potentially never done before, but certainly not done it very much at all. Um, it's certainly something that I would advise to people if they're feeling as poorly as I sort of feel. And I'll put that in context, I'm, I'm fine. Like I feel fine normally, but obviously training wise, the body was just telling me it wasn't ready to do any hard work. Um, um, and I've said it plenty of times now, this prep has got me very, very well prepared physically. Um, so that's not going to be my limit to come race day. So I certainly didn't need to be chasing anything at this stage. Um, and with the last few days being pretty full on and the next three or four days going to be full, full on and then traveling out to Bustleton or Perth and Bustleton, um, mid next week, um, just didn't really feel like I was going to be gaining anything by pushing through and, and getting on with it. So I guess that's, uh, me sharing a little bit of growth um from my end as the athlete um as i said it's something i would never have done uh five years ago and ultimately part of the reason why I forced myself to have a two or three year break from from the rigors of training and racing because it was uh not healthy i guess um and so yeah there you go i've uh, i've been saying that i wanted to share a session where it wasn't going well because uh, that first week I was I was flying and you know most of most of the days have been going really well and I've been feeling good and or getting through it and and you know having that positive adaptation uh, but today I just didn't feel like that was going to happen plus now it um, you know I still was riding for about 45 minutes so I gave it a proper shot and I know like I know now within myself that I gave it everything I could have, and then I just made the pragmatic, logical decision. So um, I'm I'm happy and comfortable with that. I'll do a little jog in the treadmill right now. Uh, Bethany's out swimming. Oakley's having a snooze. Um, so I'll jog on the treadmill, um, and then uh, I'm either going to start the drive to Sydney, which is about an eight to nine hour drive in total. We're either going to start this afternoon, depending on what the fires do or I'll do the whole drive tomorrow. So if I end up driving this afternoon, I might, I'll probably do some Pilates because I always feel good after that and that'll help me stretch out. And then I'll do a swim tomorrow morning. If I end up driving the whole day tomorrow, I'll probably just do the Pilates tomorrow, um, probably at the end of the drive to straighten out. At this stage, I've got a uh, solid key run session planned for Saturday morning, but got 48 hours till I get there so I'll just reassess when I get there and probably leave it right until the warm-up to um, confirm if I'm going to go through with that or whether I'm just going to do something a bit more controlled and uh, in any case I'll keep you guys posted I'm going for a run Jeez.